girlfriend of Liberal Minister Matt King publicly shares his sex with fellow MP. And now ex-girlfriend of Liberal Minister Matt Keane has shared texts he sent to a fellow MP requesting sex late last year. When your boyfriend cheats on you, when you're away with family, Caitlin Keage wrote in an Instagram post next to a screenshot of the exchange on Thursday. Keage, who was a senior advisor to Mel Carl Turnbull, shared that the 27th of December conversation between the New South Wales Innovation Minister and member for Miranda Rulini Pettinus. And now ex-girlfriend of Liberal Minister Matt Keane has shared texts he sent to a fellow MP requesting sex late last year. When your boyfriend cheats on you, when you're away with family, Caitlin Keage wrote in an Instagram post next to a screenshot of the exchange on Thursday. Keage, who was a senior advisor to Mel Carl Turnbull, shared that the 27th of December conversation between the New South Wales Innovation Minister and member for Miranda Rulini Pettinus. Radio host Kate Langbrook made headlines when she said sleeping with a married man is a shitty thing to do. But isn't she right? Post continues. In it, Keen tells Pettiness he's tempted to drive from where he's staying to see her. Miss me hot, lol, she replied. The New South Wales Minister's response, yup. Really need to f asterisk asterisk ku. After pettiness told him he has CK for that, the 36-year-old asked, "Is that no? It's that time of the month." The 30-year-old replied, to which he sent back, "Okay, come up later, x." Alongside the screen shot in a now deleted Instagram post, Keage, 30, wrote, I was in Adelaide trusting my partner not to play up. But alas, here we are. Another minister getting away with his predatory behavior. Keen Hant commented on the texts, only giving a short statement on Thursday evening saying his relationship with Keage was over, the Daily Mail reports. I am deeply sorry my relationship with Caitlin ended in such a spectacular and sad fashion. I wish her all the best. It may be scandalous, but it's not grounds for sacking, according to New South Wales Premier Gladys Berejiklian. And now ex-girlfriend of Liberal Minister Matt Keane has shared texts he sent to a fellow MP requesting sex late last year. When your boyfriend cheats on you, when you're away with family, Caitlin Keage wrote in an Instagram post next to a screenshot of the exchange on Thursday. Keage, who was a senior advisor to Mel Carl Turnbull, shared that the 27th of December conversation between the New South Wales Innovation Minister and member for Miranda Rulini Pettinus. Radio host Kate Langbroke made headlines when she said sleeping with a married man is a shitty thing to do. But isn't she right? Post continues. Ennett, Keane tells Pettiness he's tempted to drive from where he's staying to see her. Miss me hot, lol, she replied. The New South Wales Minister's response, yup really need to f asterisk asterisk ku. After pettiness told him he has CK for that, the 36-year-old asked, is that a no? It's that time of the month, the 30-year-old replied, to which he sent back, okay come up later x. Alongside the screen in a now deleted Instagram post, Keage, 30, wrote, I was in Adelaide trusting my partner not to play up. But alas, here we are. Another minister getting away with his predatory behavior. Keane hasn't commented on the texts, only giving a short statement on Thursday evening saying his relationship with Keage was over, the Daily Mail reports. I am deeply sorry my relationship with Caitlin ended in such a spectacular and sad fashion. I wish her all the best.
may be scandalous, but it's not grounds for sacking, according to New South Wales Premier Gladys Berejiklian. Barnaby Joyce has had to answer to criticism of his sexual relationship with a staff member. Post continues. What I've read this morning is extremely disappointing, Berejiklian and said on Friday. I'm personally disappointed in him, and have told him so, but it is nonetheless a personal matter. Meanwhile, Barnaby Joyce has announced on Friday he will step down as National Party leader during a party meeting on Monday, foregoing his role as Deputy Prime Minister. This comes weeks after Joyce's affair with the former staff member of his, Vicky Campion, was exposed. Joyce has since split from his wife of 24 years, Natalie, and is now expecting a child with his new partner. This week, claims of sexual harassment have been made against the member for New England, which he asked to be referred to Western Australia Police.